Hey everyone, Michelle McGregor with Evolution Productions here. I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how to uh, set up for a return program feed in the green room that you can adjust the audio on so you can lower it if you need it uh, to be a little bit quieter and you can all chat while your other caller is live. Okay, so here's what we want to happen. Um, this is my green room setup here. I have a previous interview, I'm sorry, a previous video that shows how to do that. Okay, um, we're going to work today with my caller A, caller one. On um, I have her set up to go to the A bus, and I have her video set to go to output two, which is my green room. Okay, so they get that return NDI uh, program feed. So what I want to happen is here on caller one, if I were to do this manually, I would have to do this. I would say, I don't want her on A. I'm gonna change her to C. I just picked C because C is for caller, which means they go. she goes to the C bus and she's the only one on the C bus and Mountain's already going to the master. So as soon as she goes to the C bus, uh, that will go to the master. Now, that's not all here. You still have to go in to the video call audio source and change this to C as well. Now, now she will route to C fully and all the rest of us are still talking on A. Okay, so all the other callers and myself. So whatever we hear from her on the master come, comes in on this program return uh, input and I can adjust that now and I can lower it so we can talk and we can hear and then I can raise it if we don't want to talk to each other. Okay, so that's how that works and let me show you how we're going to set that up with triggers. Let's just reset these guys um, and I, th I think I forgot to clear it. I'm going to clear these so we can start from scratch. Okay, so this is how we're going to do it. Let's just talk our way through it. On transition in, we want the audio bus A off. So we want the audio bus off on call one. What bus? Bus A. Add. Now, uh, same thing. When we leave on transition out, we have to think about this. We want that A bus back on. Audio bus on A. Add. Okay. Then. On transition in, we want audio bus on C, call one, right? We're going to change this to C because we want the C on now. And then on transition out, I guess I just had that there, we want the C bus off, off, add. Okay, that's that should take care of this, these buttons here, okay? Those buttons there. Oh, by the way, I have G highlighted or clicked because that's how that's how I'm hearing them. I'm hearing them on G. So uh, okay, so we're not quite done yet because we still have to change the video call input. Remember, so on transition in, we're going to go. This one's a little different. We're going to go to the input. And we're going to scroll down. And we're going to go to the video audio video call audio source and for whatever reason, we have to do it differently here. We have to say bus C, okay? On transition in, we want bus C to go on. Okay, and on transition out, we want bus A to go on, add that. Okay, so now we should have all the things we wanted, we should have that, and let's see if it works. So right now call A, she comes in on A, that's how she comes in. We wanna see if transition works. Let's take it and now let's look. Call one is off of A, she's on C. Over here, she is on C. Again, so now the rest of us, we're still on A. We can talk to each other. We can adjust her program return, so our program return. So if we can't hear each other, we can pull that down and talk and then put it back up again. Then on the way out, 
Here we are. Let's go back here and see if it worked. Audio source is back on A, back on A here, and off of C. So it did work. So that's great. Happy days. Um, hopefully this helps with uh, some of the routing for you guys. Um, if you like it, subscribe and all that good stuff. And uh, happy streaming.